Welcome to the second of the series of tutorials on how to use the Nintendo Miguel Network of Schools resource wiki. I'm going to show you the absolute easiest ways to add content to this wiki, whether you are, have editing privileges or whether you are just a user from a Nativity Miguel Network of School. First thing you're going to do is click on Submit a Resource. And once you click on Submit a Resource, you will see later on here uh, these tutorials and other resources that will help you uh, navigate and kind of get a feel for how to do things. Over here, you're going to see a simple form in which you can fill out your name, the name of your lesson, the description of it, tag it. And once you submit that, it will be sent to the Nativity Miguel School's uh, moderator, who will later post it, if it is approved, to the Nativity Miguel uh, resource blog, which you can click here by clicking on Lesson Resources. It will take you here, where you will see all of the different resources categorized by subject. That's why it's very important that you tag things. And you can click on any one of those subjects and see all the lesson ideas from that particular subject area. That's the easiest way to add a resource. If you have editing privileges, you can also add a resource in your content specific area uh, by clicking on teachers, or you can click on principals or whatever. Uh, each of the content areas, such as language arts, has a very similar setup that you can see here that has content standards, benchmarks, course plans, and content resources. All of the content resources connect to websites uh, outside of this wiki. Down here, uh, you see more resources. Under more resources, you can click any of these and it's going to take you to a file cabinet. I'm going to take you to the science one. Under science here, the more resources, we've got lab manuals, experiment repositories, and science worksheets. I'm going to take you to the science worksheets file cabinet. Here you can see a number of worksheets uh, that I've already uploaded that people can access and download and view uh, anytime that they would like. If you would like to add your own and you have editing uh, privileges, you just click on add file and you can add a file from your computer. So say for instance I want to add Soundwave Energy. It's a bubble chart. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to upload it and bang there's my Soundwave Energy file and someone can download that anytime they would like. Let's say that I want to add a website. This time I click add file, click website. I'm going to go to uh, cyrus.com Oops, yes, cyrus.com and this is a nice website. I just put in my description right here. It's a great search engine for science specific material. I click upload and now that resource is shared with anyone who goes to this page. So I can leave that. I can go back to science. If I want to add something to lab manuals, I can click on lab manuals and I just click add file and I can add a file from my computer to the web, anything that I would like. If I would like to go back to language arts, I can do the same thing on language arts. Uh, click on worksheets, add anything that I would like by clicking add file. So quick review, anytime that you want to add a resource, you can first click on submit a resource and contribute a lesson idea right here which describes your lesson or you can go to your content specific area and click on the resource that you would like to add, click add file and you will be done.